Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to route the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. Firstly, what you want to do is you want to head on over to Link 1 and download Keys 3. As you can see, it has already downloaded there. Then you want to click on it and run the installer and install Keys 3. After it has installed, you want to run it and then close it. So check in the tray just in case keys is still running. We don't want it to be running. We just need it to install some drivers. So once you've installed keys 3, start it and then close it. Now that's done. Then you can head on over to the second link where you will scroll down and go to that link wait for it to load up and go here here you want to look for the device that you are using so I'm using a Note 3 and you want to check the model number so mine is SMN9005 N9005 is there you want to click on file so N9005 you want to click on file and then you want to scroll down and download it once the file has finished downloading you want to open the file destination so if you're using Google Chrome click on the little arrow press show in folder once you've pressed that you want to extract that file CF auto root so let's extract all and extract it right there and now you want to right click on um, right click on Odin 3 and press run as administrator depending on whether or not you have a pass password you may or not you, you may or may not have to put a password in for this bit I can't talk now get the USB cable that came with your Note 3 and plug it into the PC after that on your f on your Note 3 press the volume down button the power button and the home button at the same time and keep holding it it might take a screenshot just keep holding it until this shows up when this shows up press volume up and whilst your whilst this shows up on your screen insert the other end of the USB into your phone Once you have done that, this this box should turn blue, the one that says 0, 4. After that, make sure that only auto reboot and F reset time are ticked. And then you can continue and press PDA. Now, if it doesn't already open to this folder, go to download. CF auto root and click on the tar file so that one and open it once you've done that wait for this to do this and now you can press the start button once you press the start button 
it should do this and that green bar should go from left to right and it should say reset like so this should appear on your phone and your phone will reboot automatically you can now disconnect your phone from the PC congratulations you're officially rooted however if you want clockwork mod recovery installed instead of the Samsung stock recovery continue watching the video after that click on link 3 in the description and download this Odin 307 as you see it's already downloaded after that you want to go to link 4 and download the latest version of clockwork mod recovery according to your phone so if you if you have KitKat click on the first link if you have 4.3 scroll down like so and find your model now now that you clicked on the link click on the first link according to your model number my one is SM N9005 and the international version is called HLTE I have the international version press download and just waiting for FS1D once the files have downloaded you, you, you want to extract Odin 307 right click and extract all once it has been extracted go ahead and open the folder and once you see Odin 3 version 3.0.7.exe right click and press run as administrator this is very important and you want to press yes once again you want to go into download mode and connect your Android device particularly note 3 to your PC once again once you've connected your note 3 it should turn blue make sure once again that auto reboot and F reset time are the only things that are ticked and now you will go to PDA navigate to downloads and cl click on the HLT clockwork mod recovery file that you downloaded once it has been added you can press start once you've pressed start that should happen and that should happen your phone will automatically reboot you can you can now disconnect it from the PC if you prefer a touch based recovery like TWRP I have a, li a link in the description below for um, TWRP as well so once you've installed clockwork mod recovery just download the TWRP zip folder from the link in the description and install it with CWM and that should replace it so if I go here and go down to note 3 if you go to open recovery and install it 
once it boots up you should see the new recovery it won't look like this because uh, I've put a theme on it and that, the best thing about this is that you can put a theme on it I currently have the Pip-Boy version 3 uh, theme but yours will look like squares like one two three four five six and I will do a separate video on all the themes that are available for the TWRP um, TWRP uh, recovery so that's about it don't forget to like this video comment on what you thought and I'm thinking of doing Android videos on Wednesday and prank calls on Friday so uh, tell me what you think don't forget to subscribe for more stuff I'll, I'll come up with more things as the channel progresses so I think I might get into gaming but I'll think about it because I currently do not have a good console at hand but anyway just subscribe and wait for random shit to happen peace